The results are finally in, and 43-year-old Kuomintang candidate Jiang Wan'an secured the coveted spot of Taipei City Mayor on Saturday, November 26. The great-grandson of former Taiwan President Chiang Kai-shek has established the family's legacy, beating out 11 other contenders. We have in particular, Jiang defeated strong candidates including Democratic Progressive Party DPP candidate Chen Shizhong and independent candidate and former Taipei Deputy Mayor Vivian Huang. Looking back, Jiang's path to success reveals a late start to the game. 其实我真的起步太晚了, as a graduate of the University of Pennsylvania Law School, Jiang practiced law in the United States for some time before returning to set up an office in 2014. However, just one year later, Jiang tossed his hat into Taiwan's political ring. After being elected legislator, Jiang became known for his strong arguments and criticism toward the DPP's amendments to the Labor Standards Act. Afterward, he made an even deeper impression among social media users during a brawl in the legislative yuan between the DPP and the KMT in 2019. On that day, the KMT was protesting against the voting in of Li Jingyong as Central Elections Commission CEC chairman. Jiang, who was among those hugging the speaker's desk in protest, shot to overnight fame as legislator Chen Yuzhen clung to him in a tight hug. Soon after, Jiang was faced with a second battle for a legislative seat. This time around, his challenger was the equally popular Enoch Wu from the DPP. In the end, Jiang came out on top, cementing his status among the favorites of the KMT, and laid the path to the mayoral bid today. Following his win, one of the biggest obstacles for him would be to shed his authoritarian family's legacy. However, his notion of renaming the Jiang Kai-shek Memorial Hall was not well received by many die-hard KMT supporters, which could become an issue as he works further up to a possible presidential bid in 2024. Wei Jiaqi, Liu Lichen, Vivian Xiao, TVBS, World Taiwan.